Okay, this is the evening of the 9th of October, and uh, I had started this once already. Unfortunately, my mother walked in and interrupted me, so now I'm having to do this spiel all over again. But hey, whatever, that's life, right? Anyway, um, today started out decently. I mean, it's been a really good day for the most part. Long, but good. Got up in time to get Kathy off to school, you know, for her for lunch and two classes that she has. And um, then uh, Jason wanted me to pick him up early because he's getting off work early. And I was a little aggravated because he wanted me to pick him up at uh, uh, one. 45 and Cassie gets out of school at 2.15 and so I was just kind of like ah and um but he talked me into going after him and I did and um you know and, and as he pointed out you know it's not like she's going to melt if we're late she's 14 going on 15 she takes the bus and trolley by herself but it's just this malfunction of mine that I don't like to be late you know and uh, anyway it turned out we weren't late which was awesome <laughs> and uh, in fact we had to wait a few minutes for Cassie so it, it worked out well and then uh, from there we took the car up to see Claudio because the check engine light is still on and uh, I mean it's been on for like weeks now maybe a month you know but I just kept driving it and finally it was like okay I gotta take it in and the thing is is I figured it was a spark plug because um, you know, back in February when I had the car fixed before, um, basically, you know, it it was moving like there was a spark plug that wasn't quite right. And Claudio had said, okay, well, you know, just keep driving it. We'll wait until the check engine light comes on, and that way it'll tell us which spark plug it is, and we'll fix it then. Well, so this, the check engine light comes on, I'm just figuring, okay, it's, you know, the spark plug. So anyway, we take it in, and, oh, God. Um, Jason ended up, we were there so long, Jason ended up having a friend pick him up. And then uh, Cassie and I waited longer until finally Claudio had a chance to look at the car, like two hours later. And it turned out nothing was wrong with the car. Literally, all he had to do was reset it because nothing came up on the diagnostic. So, yay, that's like a 100 bucks I don't have to spend now, at least not on that. And then what was really cool, too, is while I was waiting, um, I started working on this story that I had clunking around in my head for the last couple of weeks, and it flowed so nice. I mean, I'm not very far into it, but it's just awesome. And uh, it's about uh, this woman who is an assassin, and um, this cat that's not really a cat, that's a man. And uh, I'll let the rest to your imagination. But it's, it's, uh, it flowed really well, so I'm hoping I can keep it going. And um, so then Kim, we went to, uh, Cassie and I went to Walmart because I had to get her some, uh, a drawing pad and some colored pencils. Then it turned out that they didn't have the pad she needed at Walmart, so we had to go to Target. And I was really skeptical that they'd even have it at Target, but they did. The only thing is, is I didn't have enough money to get her the good pack of colored pencils that I really wanted to get her, so I could only get her the 12 pack, which kind of sucked, but you know, what are you going to do? And uh, anyway, came home, ate, um, I had to do some stuff here, like clean out uh, the li my litter box. I was trying to get Cassie to clean out hers, but I am so proud of her. She um, has just been working on her stuff in the evening her classes for i high it's it's great she's already you know i don't know how far she's already done her english everything she's supposed to do for english she's done a lot of her french the only thing she's having trouble with is the math which i knew that was going to be the problem um, she's going to go down on thursday and see about getting help because she really needs help with math there's no way around it <laughs> anyway um I'm just very happy that that's, you know, how she's um, going and um, that she's just, she seems excited and she's doing so well. She also wants to go to homecoming and because she's still at her high school for a couple of classes, she's still eligible to go and um, so that's awesome, you know, and uh, don't know how we're going to get the tickets, but she's got a dress 
and she's got several people that she can go with. So, you know, it's nice because I never had that opportunity. You know, no one ever took me to the, <laughs> to a dance. I, I just, I was too mousy and quiet, and, you know, all my friends were girls for the most part. So, you know, mm, that was that. And then, um, okay, <laughs> i got to think, what else, what else, what else? Anyway, after taking care of the cats and everything and getting Cassie to take care of the cat, her cat, and um, do her work, she took a shower and I just put on uh, TV. Face Off was on and Face Off was... Face Off was just awesome.